in this video we are going to be talking more about some of the special effects that you can add to your video. Um, there's a couple different ways you can do this. Um, let's start with some of the audio effects. Now you'll notice on your audio tracks there's listed uh, a number of headings for what kind of audio you're going to add. You have your Meve heading which is any audio that's part of your account, the shared heading which is basically any audio that if you're collaborating with other people they've shared to this project so that you have access to it but they also have some different stock footage or stock audio like action party drama atmosphere different things you can add to a video so this particular one has audience booing so I can come down here and add it to one of my audio tracks and you see if I kind of hover between, it'll actually create another audio track. So I have a couple layers of audio here. I now have my background music, I have my voiceover, plus I have this sound effect which happens to be an audience booing. So if I hit preview, As you can see, the animals in this I hear myself, very happy and, free. and then I hear a sound that I never hear. but that is a great way to add extra to stuff to your video basically special effects so you can add these things for you know just dramatic effect for a laugh or just to add a little bit more to your video but you can add many layers of audio um, you can then use this layer to add other sound effects so I can later on add applause to it I, it's very easy to trim the media and change the uh, the length of it and the duration or cut out the beginning or end I can add more voiceovers later, but that is basically your audio effects. Um, your transitions, those are other effects you can do. These are very nice for when you're going to transition different clips. Now, this doesn't work so much on audio clips, but if I have more video in here or more photos, I can come in here and drag some photos and add them to when I want them actually on my main title, my main track. Transitions only work on the main track and they have to be put between two clips. Now when I'm on my transitions, I can pick, I like the cross blur, and if I drag that between, I can add that here. I usually pick the same transition if in a video, I don't like to switch them up. But now if I click play, I'm going to see this video will change to that. And, it's and then that video will change much nicer than just that hard cut that just goes from one to the other adds a little bit of depth to your video and also makes it just look a little bit more professional but those are your transitions you can add another feature you can add are graphics now the graphics have a couple different options you can add um, titles to label something you can add kind of the titles like you would on a newscast to um, show a, a different situation or to set up a clip or even to um, you know kind of label an interviewer you can add an end credit you can add um, your end credits that will it looks like they'll scroll you have a main title you can add at the beginning or any of these effects so if I want to go in here I can add a main title and say you know what I'm gonna put that at the beginning and this main title when I click on it is gonna give me some different features in order to edit it. Now let's leave that text alone for now and I'm gonna come over here and go back to click done go back to graphics I can add the end here at the end of my main video and I can even add some credits there very easy to do um, one of the effects you can do is you can add a text bubble on top of something so if you wanted to I can come in here to these penguins and I can add a thought bubble I just drag that effect here and then when I click edit it says okay what do you want to do to this thought bubble well I can write in what they're saying well they live in a cold place now I can also resize this make it more fitting now I can move it around I'm gonna to try to match it up I see this photo the one penguins right here I might move this above try to move this in the top center and I can go this high and try to make this I can move this around to about here I'm trying to just ballpark it so that it looks like it'll match up with this picture now if I go like this and click play and actually I'll shorten this up a little bit so it seems like it appears we can start our video it'll transition and it adds that little comic effect on um, this can be great for you know a humorous moment on a photograph or to add a little bit extra to still picture or it can be just uh, a tool that you use to label something or to point out 
something that you want the audience to notice. But those are some of the main effects you have access to right here in this toolpad.